So in this game, there's this weird thing where it looks like I have resample enabled, but it's actually doing that when I'm playing the game. I'm not sure why it did that, so I'm sorry about that. If the video looks like that, it's not because I didn't disable resample. It's just messed up. I gotta figure out why it's doing that. Okay, anyways, enjoy the video. Why this game is really hard to gain money. I bust my butt off, and I play the game, and my butt get flattened from the chair, and eventually I get 400 money! Really? Please do something about this. I can't really play the game without money and good weapons, and I don't even have a debit card to buy credits. You can say I'm poor, but I love this game, but but it's ruined by suffering while getting money. Please feel me. Red is the cutest complaint I have ever read. <laughs> I don't have a food review for you guys today. I'm actually starving, but I do have some frozen coffee I made, and I'm just gonna go and try some of that for you. Now, see, the coffee's pretty good, but the ice is kind of a negative. It's kind of nice to make it a little fluffy when you blend the ice, but the downside is the ice is really, really cold, and my teeth are sensitive to that, so if you don't have sensitive teeth like me, you may be good to go. That may just be the coffee for you. So today I got an interesting game for you guys. I played a little bit yesterday. I got some gameplay. I don't know if I'm going to put that in the beginning of this video or not, but if I do, well, maybe you already saw it. Maybe I'll put it at the end. I don't know. There's beer bottles and a Christmas tree in there. This game's called Warface, and I heard of it before, but I never actually played it on my old laptop because my laptop was just way too garbage to actually play games and record. But now that I have a kind of capable computer, I can run this. I could run it all and get like 120 FPS, but I'm trying to keep the settings up just a little bit to make it a little prettier and the game's already started I just realized that I thought we were in some pregame thing I've been playing too much CSGO but the thing about this game is the sniping is really really good like this intervention is kind of slow but overall the sniping is very solid you never really get hit markers and I think if I get another sniper it'll be a lot faster pace but I just haven't gotten to that point yet this map is trailer park it's basically an over glorified trailer park because I've never seen a trailer park this night As you can see right there, just right off the bat, the sniping is very solid. I haven't played free-for-all in this game yet, but I think I might just do that for this video after this game. What would be a game if I didn't play free-for-all on it? Boom, look at that. There's fucking final stand in this game. Oh, hey, how's it going? I was just reloading my gun, and I died with my fucking head against the bit. Okay, come on, buddy. Let's get a move on. Let's get it going. Let's get it going. What's going on? One thing I found that's cool about this game is you can go up to certain walls and you can actually get your teammates to help you climb up them to give it a little more verticality. I haven't really found it super useful, at least in Team Deathmatch, but it's definitely cool. It's something I wish fucking COD had with all the limitations they put on you being able to climb stuff. Like, the verticality in Modern Warfare 2 is great, and then it seems like every other recent COD has not done a good job of that. All the maps just feel like you're just sitting flat running around on a flat ground. I think you guys know what I mean. I've complained about this. Okay. All right. All right, let's see what we got here. Got a rocket launcher. All right. And I'm dead. I didn't see that thing. I haven't used that before. After playing so much CSGO, it really sucks not to have that mic chat element. Hey, come here. Let's climb. Hey, a hey, faggot. Come on, let's do this. There we go. Come on. Hey, what the fuck are you doing? Nope. Whatever. I don't, I don't care. <laughs> Okay, I can't see shit. I didn't know how to slide either, but apparently slide is F, which is absolutely ridiculous in this game. People drop completely to the floor. Oh yeah, look at that. Clipping through the fucking truck. It ain't nothing, baby. Look at that. Look at that slide. I can slide too. Let's go. You wanna have a little... Yeah, what's up? What's up, bitch? Executed. We're about to play free-for-all. I've never actually played that before, so this is gonna be interesting. And the maps on here are different for different game modes, so I've actually never played any of these maps. Got one. That's my first kill of the game. Work my way over. Oh, okay, you're just gonna slide and kill me. I have a feeling free for all is gonna be a lot harder than every other game mode in this game. Because in Team Deathmatch, you can just snipe the spawn, and it's really easy on here. Oh my god, like, we got people sliding and jumping. That does not happen that often in Team Deathmatch. I mean, it happens, but you don't have people constantly doing it. One thing I like is the sound design in this game is very... Did I even name... I went this whole video without even naming the game. The game's name is Warface. The sound design is actually really good. The game doesn't look too bad visually, but I just love that you can actually hear what everybody's at oh shit oh shit oh 
Oh, got a clip first game of free for all, baby. Oh, that was that was pretty good. I don't even know if that was a quad on screen. I don't even know what the standards are for this game. That they hit up the Warface montage community and they're gonna laugh at me. The game can feel a little clunky at times, like when I snipe somebody and I try to switch to my pistol, it doesn't let me. I just have this feeling that the free for all community plays just a lot more hardcore than like team deathmatch and stuff, kinda like how Call of Duty is. Like, if you guys play Call of Duty, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Like, it's not that I can't play good in COD Free For All now, but it's that I can't get a lead. It's all... How the fuck did that not hit him? How did that not hit him? How did that not hit him? I'm so bad, man. My hands are freezing. That's a good excuse. Yeah, we'll go with that. The game is so easy and I can't even aim worth a shit. How the fuck? Yeah, guys, that's Warface. It's a pretty fun game, to be honest, and it's a free-to-play. So, it's a good alternative to CSGO and COD when you're tired of it. It's not something I can play for hours on end, but it is really fun to pick up and play when you decide to play it. It just gives you a good break between other games. Anyways, guys, if you did enjoy, be sure to drop that like. And if you want to see more Warface gameplay, let me know because I'd love to bring it. I like having a little more variety. Maybe I'll do some more free-to-play shooters or something like that. Anyways, I will see you guys on the next one. It has been T. And I'm out.